So right over here we have the heart of the system, which is the sump. Uh, we have the single pump of the system there, and it pumps in three directions. So the first outlets go to the fish tanks, which uh, overflow into our filter. Um, our filter is a drum filter, but uh, we got it uh, without some of the necessary equipment, so we had to work around it a bit. Um, yes, and, and back into the sump. Uh, from the sump we also pump water via the same pump into the biofilter, which then overflows back into the sump. And the third outlet of the pump goes to the plant cycle. So in the sump we have a mixture of uh, both uh, the water straight from the fish, the biofiltered water and the water filtered through the plants. So this is a sedimentation tank and we will use this if this is uh, not in circulation in the system, but we will use the water from this tank to feed the plants uh, in this row that are growing in soil, just to make the comparison uh, of the uh, aquaponic system and soil. Each tank is an active uh, 2 cubic meters, around 2 cubic meters. Um, the water temperature is around 20 degrees Celsius. Uh, our biofilter is 1 cubic meter and so is our sump tank. And we have around 30 to 40 kilograms of fish per, uh, in all this volume, so we could have a lot more fish. Um, our plant site is around 40 square meters and could be bigger, but we are again intending to use the water for irrigation in traditional farming. Uh, we are using tilapia. And then in the sedimentation, we are trying to add uh, red claw crayfish. So you eat, uh, you kill and eat the fish as well? Uh, yeah, yeah. these are intended to be lunch for the participants of the, of the training school. Okay.